Welcome to my backyard. It is so wonderful to see you. Thank you. You got the invite. I'm so very happy that you are here. Wait a second. This is not my backyard. Uh, um... Well, let, let's keep going, because I thought you were here for a backyard play, you see. And... Well, my backyard is a lot smaller than this, and I was expecting it to be the evening, and, like, you know, my backyard has this lovely view of Los Angeles. That's where I live. Um, oh, by the way, my name is Haley, and welcome to my backyard. I am here to perform for you. I've been working on a little... Je ne sais quoi. A little play, if you will. Um, it's something that I do to kind of entertain myself at home, you know? Have you heard of uh, a play called The Tempest? You have! Okay, great. So basically, you know, it's about some, like, drama, a ship, an island, some magic, and then there's love, and everybody lives kind of happily ever after? Yeah. So there's a scene that I'm working on right now, and it's the one with this amazing character called Ariel. Anybody who know Ariel is? You do? Okay. So, I'm working on a scene right now, and um, I'm looking for some, like, moves. Because if you don't know, I'm actually not an actor, I'm a dancer. Yeah. So I'm, like, looking for some moves for Ariel. And so I was wondering if you all wanted to jump into the pond, and uh, I want to sing you the Ariel song, and then I want you to give me your most aerial moves. Now imagine, Ariel's very magical. Um, how I imagine her, and maybe some of you have imagined her, is she has, uh, she's really big. And she's, she's a little bit spooky, you know? And, uh, and she has, a, like, a haunting voice, and she sings a haunting song as she's gobbling down ships. So, can we, can we give this a little, a little whirl? Yeah, so everybody, into the pond. Here we go. Get in there, get in there, there we go. All right. Are you, how's the water? Is it okay? All right, did the owner of this backyard put the heater on? Is like the water okay or is it too cold? All right. So imagine this, you are at the bottom of the ocean. If you look above you, you see a ship on fire, okay? And, like, maybe if you're feeling super dramatic and dark, there's, like, sailors falling off the ships and coming under the surface and swimming for their lives, okay? And you are the cause of this. And so, find, like, a beginning pose, maybe? Like, how would, how would you be, like, an aerial pose? Yeah, ooh! Yes, you are feeling it. I appreciate that. Get into it. Good. All right. All right, Burger Brains. How's it going? That looks good. Okay. Are you ready? The curtains open, and Ariel starts singing. And now dance to her. Dance to her. Full fathom by thy father's life. All his bones are coral made. Those are bones that were his eyes. Nothing of him that doth fade. But he suffer a sea change into something rich and strange. See nymphs hourly ring its knell. Hark! I hear them ding. Dong. Bell. Good. I liked that move, how you were, like, stroking your fancy hair. That was really good. I also liked you. I could feel the, like, seaweed floating off of your arms. And you two, you two are really, really good. Except I think I would, I would, I would cast you both. 
maybe as uh, the nymphs and naiads. You have more of that. Very good performers, but not so dark and brooding as Ariel. Anyway. Thanks for helping me workshop that. It's been a while since I've touched the Tempest, you know, but I was like, a, like a year or so ago, I was in isolation at home. And so like, I was like really digging deep just to keep my sanity in this play, you know? And, and then, um, it feels good to revisit some old material that, you know, never really left my living room. Yeah. Um, but on that note, Thanks for helping me workshop that. I want to keep working on this play, and then maybe next time I see you, if I see you, I don't know how. It's very bizarre, because I'm pretty sure I was going to end up in my backyard, and this, this is most definitely not my backyard. But I feel like it would be like, imagine this. In The Tempest, there's a wedding scene between Ferdinand and Miranda, like the, the two young lovers, and like, for some reason, this just right here, this framing, boom. Wouldn't that be gorgeous for a wedding scene? Like walking along the pathway through the water, but not on the water for a wedding? I mean, I think, I think the next time I come back to this place, I think that's going to be the scene we workshop. Is that a good idea to you? Okay. All right. Well... I'm going to take off and figure out my way back home from here because this is going to be an interesting journey. But y'all, I'll see y'all later, okay? Have a good one. Bye.